bigger, taller and quicker rotating offshore wind turbines play an important role in renewable power generation. The energy production is high because of the strong winds and low wind turbulence due to them being free of all obstacles like buildings, hills or mountains. But the harsh offshore environment with heavy rain causes the blaze to erode, leading to a significant reduction in wind turbine efficiency and energy production. In LM Wind Power's Technology Center in Kolding, Denmark, experts are examining the erosion on the blades. They lose mass, the aerodynamic flow is disturbed, and energy production is reduced. Look at this. This is uh, an aluminum sample completely destroyed by rain droplets. This has been done by, uh, by our simulated weather conditions here in this test center, where we test materials and uh, processes for new uh, materials going onto wind turbine blades. These pits and grooves are all made solely from rain droplets while hitting these specimens at very high speed, more than 600 kilometers an hour. To overcome this problem, new technologies are being tested here. The first is a tape. It protects the blade from erosion, but it doesn't last for the lifetime of the blade. So researchers have created this innovative polyurethane coating system. It significantly increases the performance of the blade while lowering the costs of maintenance and downtime. In this machine, researchers test the performance of the polyurethane coating. The machine simulates rain. Inside, the blades rotate at more than 600 kilometers per hour with water dropping onto them. The water comes from 600 little nozzles. Researchers have found that the new coating lasts around five times longer than the industry standard. The aerodynamic profile of the blade is studied in the wind tunnel. A very high speed wind is produced, 380 km per hour, and directed towards the blade profile. Engineers can calculate the loss of energy production caused by erosion. These new technologies are being tested within the framework of the European project Windtrust, aimed at reducing the cost of wind energy generation by further improving the reliability of key components of the turbine. The newly developed materials and technologies uh, can really help uh, making the, the maintenance cost uh, a, a lot lower. And, uh, and maintenance cost is a, is a essential issue when you talk about wind energy offshore. If you can limit the, the amount of repair work and, uh, and downtime, it will be a great advantage. Offshore wind turbines have no space limits or problems of noise for surrounding areas. They can be taller and are more able to catch the winds. However, their installation, maintenance and transport of energy to the mainland are more expensive. Researchers are working to make offshore wind turbines more cost-effective and increase their importance in the context of renewable energies.